Hey, um, this isn't Dwarf Fortress. No, this is the DF Starter Pack. Whoa, which what's is, happening right now? Well, it looks like you're uh, pulling a classic Windows and just highlighting stuff. Drawing boxes. Drawing boxes. I've been doing that for years. So this is the DF Starter Pack. Um, it's fun because it comes with a lot of different mods kind of built into it. It basically simplifies all of the stuff that you would normally yeah. spend two hours setting up in-game. Right. In we so, actually showed this off when we started way back, yep. first episode. We used this to select a graphic uh, pack, so yes. we went... What did we go with, the Space... Um, I think we're using Mayday. Mayday, maybe? Okay. Or Space Fox? It might be I can't Space even Fox. remember. I think it's Space Fox. Um, so yeah, so it's great. Uh, it's got a bunch of mods pre-built into it. You can uh, do a lot of game selection, game start stuff, um, which is really cool. Um, and one of the other things you can launch from here is... Dwarf, Dwarf Therapist. Dwarf Therapist, which... We've been talking about on and off for a while. People really want us to use it. Yep, a lot of people have commented that uh, that they would love to see us use it. So we're going to give it a shot. Um, I've used it before a little bit, but it's been a while. Explain um, to me before we jump into it exactly what this does, because your normal way of playing is you have a spreadsheet right. where you keep so, track of who has what job. And because everything. I'm OCD to a degree, um, and. Uh, because I love Excel anyway, because I'm crazy, I really like doing this myself. Um, so I keep track of what skills my dwarves have, I keep track of, you know, who I've set to do what, things like that. Dwarf Fortress, or I'm sorry, Dwarf Therapist does all of that automatically. Um, you can go in, you can see who is skilled in what different areas, you can see um, how much skill they have in the different areas. Like, let's say you have two miners, oh, you can useful. see one is a legendary miner and one is, you know, a novice. So does it integrate into the UI here, or is this something we're going to It be doesn't. We'll, so we're we'll bouncing have to, out. We'll have to bounce it out. In fact, let's Alt-Tab now. So that was kind of one thing I was... One reason we were hesitant to do it for right. a while is we didn't want to just be jumping to the desktop every 30 seconds of the video. Right. But anyways, I zoomed in here so we can actually kind of see what's going on. Uh, Alt-Tab out. Oh. And here we have a little warning. Said it was not able to connect. There we go. Oh, sweet. There we go. So here, let's make that full screen. Whoa. Um, and let's see if we can zoom in a little bit because I we... I don't know how to do that. Check the windows. Oh, no, oh. it doesn't look like it's a view. Um, can expand or collapse. That's yeah. not doing anything. Can I expand Ashtesh? <laughs> I've been I've been I wondering think, that since day one. I think short of going into like the actual window settings and doing some yeah. DPI tinkering, I think we probably can't make this bigger. When so. I when I go to cut this in post, um, I might be able to just scale this part up a little bit, so we can you know I'll play around with that. So hopefully people will be able to see it. So basically, we're looking at all the possible skills they could have. We can make the fonts bigger. If that'll help. Yeah, let's make the fonts bigger. Let's go to 10, 11. No, more, more, 12, more bigger. 14. More. That's gonna be, it's gonna be large. Large and in charge. Cell um, size. Oh, there you go, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bust that up a little bit, see what that looks like. Oh, great. So this is Dwarf Therapist. Um, as you can see, we've got all of our dwarves listed along the left side. Ashdash, Katten, Ilral, Cattle, Kivish, Zibrak, and Urvog. Yep. And then you can see all of the skills in the game possible. And you can see who's marked with what. Um, so the black dots, I believe, mean... Um, how much, how much skill they have in that area. They um, the purple is um, whether or not that skill is on for that dwarf. Enabled. Yeah. Got it. Um, so like you can see um, under farming, uh, only one person actually has farming on growing. Um, 
That's this, farming this, right here. this row there, yeah. Just cattle. Um, just cattle, but everybody's skilled in it, and that's because um, we have our game set to anybody can harvest um, plants. So when it's harvest time, all the dwarves go and harvest together. So, so that's Rod's done a fair bit of harvesting, I guess. Exactly, yeah. Um, so we can see um, we had Irvod set to um, be a plant gatherer. When we first came to our fort, we gathered some plants. Um, we but haven't really much. done that since. Yeah. Um, and we've since then taken that off because we wanted to make sure he wasn't doing anything else. So I think we disabled all of his abilities. Um, in the same way, we took Tesh's fishing off because of uh, the elvish attack. So yeah, that was a really short-lived yeah. attempt. Yeah. So and then fishing. we can we can cut down. You know, you can look at all military skills, social, um, which is super cool. Like you can actually see uh, disease resistance, some of the, some of the attributes. Oh wow! So it's a very powerful tool. Um, very helpful. You can really dig into it. I don't think we're going to dig too deeply. Now we can see everything here, but can we also? Effect? Can we make changes here, or only the game? I don't think so. It I think feedback in. Yeah, in fact, it's just reading. I think at least when I used it, yeah, you have to refresh it gotcha. um, whenever you want to get a fresh look at so the dwarves. So the problem, or like the the hardest thing in Dwarf Fortress, when we're trying to remember who does what, yeah. is you can't see everybody's abilities right. at once. You, you have, have to actually go into each go person. into each dwarf kind of scroll through the menu with plus or minus to see each category of skills whereas here we can it's as simple as just going through these and really yeah. most of what we want is under labor so right most of what we're seeing is all on one single page and the great thing about dwarf therapist is you can you can choose like custom filters you can um you know search for stuff you can sort in a whole number of different ways. I see you were just looking at the group by. So, yeah, so we can sort you know, by health. Yep, we could group by happiness. You could see who's... These guys have some minor health issues. What's, yep. what's wrong? So if you... Um, Where is health? So I think health might be under attributes. Maybe it's... Or there, look, you got a whole... Oh, I really love that yeah. we can see like their personality description here. Broken out in ways that... Um, yeah. That are useful. Oh, cattle very easily falls into love. That's sweet. Yeah. I didn't um, know that's it could be that cattle. like some of them were thirsty earlier, mm -hmm. was caught in the rain. Is that their health issue? No, that's not a health issue, I don't think. I mean Ilral, yeah. we know we know what happened to him. Yeah. Um I mean it's possible it's counting that, but here, let me take over the mouse for a second. Yes. Yeah. So that's no, that's not see. it. Got social. Do, 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 do. Um, this is so cool. Neighbors, let's see. Um, I think we can let's see if we can add some other. As soon as health. you look at it, here we go. You know. So I just added a health tab. Ah, okay, cool. Um, so Aztesh has an infection in his left wrist. Um, is this which updated? Is I mean, I assume it's yeah. recent. Yeah, I mean, let's read dwarves, yeah. Hmm. Okay. So this is current. Um, I think he's had an infection for a while. Yeah, um, he's been doing So okay. his movement has been impaired. Um, he's unconscious. He's still, he's the one who's still sleeping oh, in the, right. the medical center. So um, he's had, you know, some fun stuff. So let's see what happened to cattle. Something's missing. You lose a... Uh, oh, he's missing some front teeth. Uh, maybe they maybe they got punched out or Did something elf during the fight. His teeth in? Yeah, that might have happened. <laughs> Damn. Um, so yeah, as you can see, it's pretty cool. Um, I feel like if you're playing Dwarf Fortress, you should definitely use Dwarf Therapist, but you should use it. You should probably play Dwarf Fortress in Windowed mode if you're going to use this, right? Because I don't think I don't think alt tabbing in and out of it full screen is going to feel. Yeah. I feel like it's going to get cumbersome kind of quickly. Maybe. I mean, you know, I, when I'm looking at this, I don't feel the need to, like, go back and check Dwarf Fortress to see, you know, oh, wait, now who is this, who is that? I can kind of get all the information I need here and then go back and just make the changes. Um, I mean, 
I think having it, yeah. being able to see both of them side by side is probably yeah. the ideal. There we go. Yeah. I'm not saying yeah. don't use it if you play full screen, but I think that would be, if I was playing and I wasn't recording it, mm -hmm. I would probably play this in like half window. I also right. have a 27 inch 1440 right, right. monitor. This... So I would play Dwarf <laughs> Fortress in like a large window. And then and you can have, have a quick reference. Have like a, a smaller window, you yeah. know, along the bottom or something for that. We can but... just kind of jump jump over or see like, okay, who's who's my miner? But we can start flipping so. back to that when we want to check. Yeah, when we're check when we're stuff. desperate. Also, once we get our migrants. Yeah. Definitely becomes we're gonna a actually lot need when you're dealing with seven dwarves, you yeah. can kind of, you know keep some amount of track of what they're up to when you're dealing with, you know, 15, 20, 30, 40 dwarves. It starts to get dwarves. a lot of... I can't even think about yeah. that many dwarves. Or over 100 dwarves. So yeah. uh, if I remember correctly, last time we found marble. Yes. And that's a big deal because this is Fluxstone, right? Yep. So marble is a key uh, reagent in making steel out of iron. Also, you can make some bitching columns out of yeah. marble. We, we actually should some carve really some really cool floors. Carve some marble. Some really cool walls. Basically yeah. any kind of... What is what is this cool little uh, diamondy... This guy right here? ...shininess, yeah. Let's take it's probably look. just some... Oh, Galena. Galena. So that's um, that's an ore of silver. What's what's the one down here? That's gold, right? Okay, that's yeah. just the gold. Okay, yeah, cool. we've, we're starting to find a lot of gold. Yeah. Gold! I kind of want gold to, in them hills. Since there's Galena here, I kind of want to dig, dig that out. Yeah. Not see if there's any more. Cool. Okay, so let's um. Let's make a plan. What do you want to do? We're still digging. I like. We need to uh, find some iron. I liked the steel thing you just said. Yeah. You said about steel. So we have. I the, like the idea the, of having steel. Is what yeah, I'm saying. we have the reagent. Um, we don't actually have the the iron ore yet, so that's something we're going to need to hopefully stumble upon. Our wall is still in progress up here. Good, good. It's <laughs> slowly going, but surely. Going slowly, but it'll get there. Um, Do you think we yeah. should set somebody to gather some plants? Um, it's up to you. I mean, some, what I would I would plants. say it's low priority. Um, so I would wait we do until have, we have migrants. We do have an idler. Yeah. Uh, Sivrek, I, the thing about... Sivrek, as usual, is doing fuck all. <laughs> Who's surprised? Well, you know what? Now we can actually go and look and see what he's assigned to task-wise. So Sivrek... He's got carpentry, yep, wood animal cutting... Animal training. Some animal training. A little bit of wound stuff. Yeah. Making soap. Burning wood, hot ash, and lye. And we then could all the way down here. Mechanics. Yep. He's really good at mechanics. He's okay at mechanics. Well, I'm not going to go so far as uh, being okay. really good. I'm going to say you it's know the only thing he's competent at, other than carpentry. He's he's okay at mechanics and carpentry. Like Iral is good at mining. If you're going to say good, Let, let's see what that. What that diamond. diamond means. Legendary. Whoa. Cool. Legendary plus one. So Jesus. he can keep leveling up um, his legendaryness. He hasn't even done that much mining. I mean, he's mined out pretty much the whole fort. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess that's fair. I mean, look who the other miner is. Irvod. I guess Irvod's doing, well. doing pretty well. Expert. Yeah. Okay, that's nothing to scoff at. Kivish, also an expert. Mm -hmm. Or professional, sorry. Yeah. Um, let's put. Let's put Sibrek on wall duty, actually. Yeah. He should be... Um, so, let's masonry? enable masonry, yeah. Well, who... So is Catton the only one building the... He's the only one building the wall right now. I guess so, yeah, it looks that way. So let's give Sibrek masonry. Sibrek, so it's C. Yep. And then L. Uh, B. P. 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 P then L. Yeah, there you go. You got it wrong. Yeah, it's, it's, it's super funny. Yep, masonry. I, <laughs> after all this time, finally. <laughs> it didn't sound like you thought it was funny. I, I'm laughing. <laughs> I'm laughing on the inside. <laughs> I love that we haven't talked about it in a while, but our our bottom little office here is um, 
is our, our bookkeeper's office, and he's been keeping the books. So that's cool. I, there's also still a splattering of still blood. Still a splattering on, of blood. On the wall here. Yeah. Also, I just noticed that um, our doctor uh, was sleeping in the hospital, which is pretty funny. Her body. He's got to yeah. take care of his patient, you know. Yeah. Pulling an all nighter. Cool. Look at all that gold. Yeah, we Let's got some serious gold now. Check out what the. It looks like we've got a lot of um, coal, too, or charcoal. In here? So that's good. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so that's awesome. Should we, so you said marble is a key ingredient in making steel. Yeah, but we, we need iron ore to... Um, How do to, we get iron get ore? Well, we need to find it. So yeah. hopefully we'll find some soon. Should we start collecting marble? Is that a thing that we should you know, um, start dragging it up to... We could, you could dig out another section. I mean, I, so um, this is all embedded in the wall right now, right? right? So right. I kind of need to... Uh, well, I think some of that... Yeah, we might as well dig that out. That's that's legit. But I think I think are these marble? Uh, I think I'm not they might sure. be. Let's look. Yeah. Yep. Yep. So what go back up to our um, stockpile up here? Yeah. Go or our floor with the uh, with our workshops. Creature occupying site. That's funny. Ah, damn it. It's probably just um, goat. Yeah. What are yeah, you it's doing? Just goat. That's funny. Stupid goat. No, they gonna... they'll, they'll do the rest of the wall. That's okay. fine. He's just going to need to fix that. So go back down to our workshops and then go to the I metal floor. Yeah. Why don't we make another um, stockpile maybe between these two? Like so right dig, here. Dig some space yeah. Out. yeah. To get that corner and actually, too. that corner could be great for. Um, for charcoal, because both of these um, workshops use, use charcoal. And then we could do this other corner over here for marble or something like that, or, you know, or just other more ore. More stuff. Yeah. Sorry, I have to, I have to fix this. It must be the same. Oh, ooh, I like that. <laughs> Thought Actually, you would. that's not what I expected you to do. I expected you to go the other direction. Good, I'm glad they're doing this before yeah, Irvod's they going. yeah. Before they dig. Well, it looks like they did dig. So no. no. Yeah, they're doing this too. Great. So that's happening. Man, so much marble. Yeah. We don't have to go too crazy with the marble. Um, There's a ton here too. Yeah. So right. that's this great. is also marble, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we need iron. Yes. Where are we gonna find it? That is a good question. Did you notice that I have this stairwell right here? I guess I told you yeah. to build that. I don't remember That's super when, funny. when that happened. It's been sitting It's not there actually for, linked to anything? No, it's just been sitting yeah. there for quite a while. So we're looking for one of three iron ores. Oh, the dogs it's are not actually called brick. iron ore. So we're looking for either hematite, magnetite, or limonite. Are those are the three the three ores. We yeah. haven't gotten any. Yeah, of them. none of those are sounding yeah. familiar. Um. Is there a bunch of stuff here at the trading post that needs to get taken in? Uh, check it out. What are these graphics here? Uh, let's see. No merchants. So it should just be. You know what? I bet our stockpile's full. That's probably why they're not taking stuff down. Mm. Well, why don't we go down to that floor and it's just? Pretty, it's pretty full. Yeah, just make some more stockpiley area. Oh, you're telling it to mine though. Oh, maybe you're doing that on purpose. Maybe I yeah. am. You got those other directions you can go to. I mean, we can just fill up this, fill up this room, this floor. We had a big stone stockpile here, I guess, in the in the corner. Wait, are those stairs in this corner here too? Wonder yeah, I don't have any recollection of that. That, that might be a that might be a marker. Yeah, look, oh, it might be a weird graphic thing. 
Yeah, it's oh, a bin. It's a bin. It just oh. bins happen to be the same graphic as up downstairs. Got it. In this graphics mod. Oh, autumn has come. Saving, saving. All right, I'm gonna expand this stockpile here. Actually, can I just use Q to expand it? No. I don't think you can expand the stockpile. I think you have to create a new stockpile. So P, um, yeah. Custom? But it's it's not gonna create it over the area that they haven't mined yet. Oh, okay. So you'd have to I'll do it. Wait. Yeah. Lots, lots of progress is being made. This is what happens when we aren't paused. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, yeah, look at it. See what it is. Oh, it went away. There it is. Go get it. I got you. Get fish. it. Get it. I got you. Sailfin, Sailfin Molly. Molly. Yeah. I knew a girl Whoa. named Sailfin Molly. No, you didn't. Shh. Was she a fish? No. <laughs> That's a no. Is that look meant no? Cool. Still got mining to do there. Yep. Let's see, has our... Oh yeah. Hell so, yeah. New... So I would do... Uh, a new marble stockpile in this corner maybe? Yeah. Though they're not done with that corner yet. Okay, so let's do the coal one over here. Yeah. So P... S for stone. Yep. And then, and then we'll just have to go in and specify a little bit more, but that's a good start. Cool. Um, Great. And then I do go in. No, no. Oh, I go to Q. Yeah. So custom, basically, you can set what... It's basically like creating a special type of, um, of stockpile, like an animal and gem stockpile. And then every time you make a custom one, all your custom ones will be animal and gem. So, so it's like... We're basically turning off everything but coal, right? Yeah, so you want that and... Um, I think it's in bars and blocks. You want to go over to bars and blocks. Enable. Yep, and then block all. Okay, we're like that. And then you want to go into... Um, should be other materials. Yeah, perfect. All right. Yeah. So the coal that you that's also selected for that will be raw coal that'll need to be processed. That's fine. Which is fine. I that's why I didn't correct you because I I think it would be. You didn't correct me because I was right. Well, I wouldn't go that far. I was actually talking to a friend about Dwarf Fortress. Uh, over the weekend, he's been. What is that that they're digging up? What is it? It looks like coal, but it's probably not. I'll be super excited. Oh, tetrahydrate. Okay, cool. Boring old tetrahedrite. Well, it's not too boring. You can get silver out of it and copper. Anyway. But go on. Talk to a friend. I was talking to my friend Jeremy about Dwarf Fortress. He's a, a longtime veteran. Probably nice. has probably been playing it longer than you. You know, playing That's a lot. He made, possible. He made this incredible. Dwarf Fortress tower that was just like this incredibly compact circle, mm -hmm. probably like this size, but just tower. Really? Yeah. And, um, ooh, caravan. Sweet caravan. Dwarven caravan. So finish your story though. Um, so anyway, he is pretty good. He's been playing the game a long time. And he was telling me about how to make something for our soldiers. Ooh that when we are training soldiers, and I don't want to spoil it, yeah. because I feel like I should explain it when we get to the point where we're actually- Where we actually have a military going. Start training up a military, but it sounds yeah. awesome. Nice. So- You cited. If you, so no spoilers, yeah, but it's if coming. You, if you're a Dwarf Fortress veteran, you'll probably know what I'm talking about. Cool, let's, let's discuss the situation. All right. Months ago, Nil Dykewimp. 
held Nyquist first, <laughs> became mayor of the Cunning Buff Daggers. All right. It's good to know. Cool. Well, at least there's no like way, crazy wars sweeping the continent anymore. Let's begin the discussion. What do we want these guys to yeah. bring us? Um, let's check it out. Oh, we don't need leather. We don't need leather. Screw leather. We don't need cloth either, I guess? Nah. We, we don't, don't want crafts. We, we want, want to sell crafts. them crafts. Yeah, exactly. Do we want to ask for iron? It's going to be expensive. I mean, possibly that's the way I mean, to go. I mean, if we're going to do... It doesn't hurt to ask them to bring it. Yeah, I mean, we could do um, steel bars. We could go straight to steel. What I... Where is steel? It's oh, there in there. Um, we might as well ask them to bring it. In worst yeah. case, we've got it by then, you know, or we can't yeah. afford it. That would be all right. No cool. gems, stone, no, no. seeds, maybe some some new types of seeds. Well, I think these are all seeds we have. I we could check and see if we're out of any of these, but might as well just. They usually bring a bunch of those anyway. So if you specify them to bring something, it'll cost more okay. for us to buy it. So that that's the reason. That's why to. earlier you said don't like make something a really high priority because right. then they'll charge extra extra for it. Yeah. We can make this stuff pretty easily, right? Yep, because those are usually wood. Um, that, that giant axe blades, Whoa. enormous corkscrews. Wow. Cool. Where so, we can make that stuff? Toys? Mm. No, that's stuff to sell. So same with instruments. instruments. Pets. Okay. So we could do some pets. I, I feel like we could also just see what they bring us. All right. It's up to you though. We're fine with those. I think we're. I don't think there's anything we specially need. It, it it feels like we're sort of in a little bit of a rut without having more dwarves. I feel yeah. like once we have more dwarves, there are going to be more things we realize that we need more right. upkeep. We're going to have to start producing more food. And oh, you drinks. know something that we don't have because we haven't slaughtered or butchered any animals it's fat. We don't have fat for soap. So you can see if actually somebody's, if they're selling soap, I don't know where that what would be. What would that extracts be under? Extracts? Maybe, maybe, that maybe, looks no, promising. No, I see no. blood. Blood. No, that's just... What about ichor? <laughs> we could get some large roach ichor. Um, so you no. don't think it's so under here? No, 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 I don't think it is. Let's see. There's some sweat. Mm. Gremlin sweat, gremlin tears. It's actually kind of kind of gruesome. Okay, it's not going to be under this one. Um, meat wouldn't be. Would it be under meat? Fat might be, but I I'm guessing we can't actually ask for fat. That's what it's looking like. We can get tripe. Yeah, delicious tripe. Yum. There might be like an other or yeah let's scroll down a miscellaneous nope don't need that stuff we might be able to make it with um lie from the miscellaneous all right well i'm gonna say we're done then wait give me once okay too late done well then we've finalized the import agreement All right, sure. Cool. Let's discuss what we're willing to offer for your craft store ship. Uh, okay, so this is what they'll pay us for the stuff we produce. Is that what I'm getting? Yep. So they particularly they want- They think our drinks are okay. Our armor and our bone scepters are <laughs> not especially desirable. Well, no, they're saying that this is what they want. This is what they're oh. needing. This is just, okay. So they'll they, pay 205 um, They really want percent footwear. For, they really want cut gems. And shields and bucklers. And they really want large So we could make, gems. for next year, we could make a bunch of um, copper shields or copper bucklers. 
Oh, that's the one they want the very most. Yeah. I see. Cool. Do we have all that copper? Shields, bucklers, footwear, cut gems. Yeah. Yeah, large gems are great, but they, they happen randomly. Farewell, Sibrek. I look forward to our meeting next year. Our fortunes, fortunes rise, rise and, and fall, fall together. together. That's what I'm going to say now whenever I'm saying goodbye to you, Wes. Now, can we tra still trade with these guys right now? We can, right? Um, they're bringing stuff uh, They probably haven't unloaded yet, but yeah. Right. We're that gonna... was just our liaison. Yeah. Now they're bringing in stuff to trade. So we should probably yeah. haul that sh all our shit back yeah. here. Yeah, yeah. That was pretty fast. Yeah. So I need to go to Q. Did we just trade last episode? We might have. We've been we've been going through stuff a lot faster. Let's so if you see. go to all, go to all stuff. Yeah. Up on the top, um, we actually have all that copper stuff. Um, oh, we. I guess we didn't get. We didn't move. We back. didn't move it. So it's just mark perfect. it for trading. Yeah. And then have we actually produced more crafts? That's the question. I don't think we have. Yeah. We didn't sell like any last time because yeah. we didn't really buy anything. So Yeah. And that was let's, just let's check our food stores. That was just last episode. And see see if we need to buy food. That's not it. Uh, Z. Uh, Z. Stocks. Repair meals, 98. So that's cool. We've got a couple cheeses. We've got plenty of drinks. We maybe have a lot of plants. Is that question? Yeah, I think I think that's out of the range of what our bookkeeper. We have too many guessing. plants. Yeah, so he's he's only uh, accurate to two digits, I think. So we definitely have more than a hundred plants. Yeah, well, I think we have something in the two seventies. Like, I think oh, that means we have between two seventy and two eighty. Got it. Got it. Um, we have plenty of eggs from our. Ducks. Yeah, wow. Got a little bit of cheese. Yeah, we should probably... We don't like, have a lot of drinks. Do some but cooking. we can clearly do some brewing. Yeah. Yeah, we should do some brewing, do some cooking. I wonder if those eggs go bad. Thank yeah. You. Yeah. Oh, puppies. Yeah, puppies. We got puppies last, or a couple episodes ago. We got more puppies now. We're going to be lousy with dogs. Yeah. We'll have, to, dogs. we'll have so many dogs that we'll just... Uh, Throw those dogs at elves. Yeah, exactly. So let's set uh, Sibric to do that thing. So if I recall, last time we turned off the requirement to have to have it be Sibric. Have it yeah. be Sibric. And it's better to have it be Sibric because he's slowly training up those skills. Um, so should I re-enable that? You think? Yeah. See. I forget where to do that. Is it's, it also right yeah? There? It's just in there. Oh yeah, it's busy. it's it's already it was already enabled. Oh. It looked like well, it reset then. itself maybe. Cool. All right. And he's I think building the wall. He has so been, yeah. We might want to tell him. In fact, he's to right stop. there. Yeah. So after he puts this wall chunk down, yeah. let's see if he goes to the depot. Yeah. Here we are watching Sibric slowly drag one piece of stone. Probably does weigh about as much as he does. Also, I don't know if you're calling him fat around. or calling the stone big. It can be both. Um, yeah. I mean, dogs love Sibric. He did train him. It's yep. the best thing he's done. Yep. Oh, why you gotta carry it so far away, man? Oh, that's... Because oh, it's, it's this kind of stone. Yeah. Alright, let's see if he goes to the depot. Cool. Let's see what happens. Mm. Boom! Right by! All okay, right. yeah. So, we go to Sibric. C... P L and we're gonna go down to stone working. Turn that off. Cool. Now he's at a loss. Yeah. Oh, he, might, he, he got, might have one more. He got a do. stone. Yeah. He made but it that's fine. to a stone. Um, yeah, they're probably just finished unloading it. So while he's doing that, let's talk about your your thoughts and feelings. How are you feeling with uh, with our fortress? I'm really getting to the Point where I'm antsy about the migrant thing. Like, yeah, I want to take this up to the next level yeah. of activity. And I've never, I've never had it taken this long. Um, it seems weird. Yeah, I almost wonder if we need to be producing more. Um, it looks like he's there, by the way. We need to be producing more. Is that the right there? Oh, yeah. I guess some of the merchants have the same graphic. They do. Yeah. yeah. 
um, to be producing more wealth, um, which mm. I know will trigger more Where are attacks. Where you going, dude? But... Oh, he better not be going to the party. Yeah, check it out. He might be. Pen yeah. past your large animal. Okay. Where are you going okay. now? Let's see if he goes. Oh, denied. See what he's doing. Sleeping. Oh, okay, sleep. yeah. Let's screw it. Interest of time. Uh, Jesus. Anyone may trade. Now, um, it looks like cattle might come. Guess again. Okay, see what see what's going on. Check that unit list. <laughs> party, 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 party. Rest, sleep, plant seeds, store item. Okay, we'll give it a sec. They'll be here for a while yet. Yeah. And so you think maybe we just need to be producing producing more? Maybe producing more. Because it's we have been in kind of a loop where we're not producing much because we have no need for right. it really. But maybe we should just be doing it for its own purposes. It looks like someone might be there. Trade! Great. Greetings from the mountain homes. Cool. We should so, trade and, and uh, wrap this episode up. Yeah. They have cheap like iron bars. Yeah. To make steel, we're going to need iron, pig iron, and, um, and just, our marble. So let's we just can get it. Yeah. We can make one piece of steel. Woo. That'll be fun. That'll yeah. be good. Oh, wait, there's more pig uh, iron right Yeah. Here. Let's grab that too. And okay. So let's it. check out the animal situation. That's always my favorite. Just uh, we got trumpet. We want to no, we, no, no. What about I'm gonna piccolo? Say right now, hello. No piccolos. Oh man, piccolo is my favorite. Is it the Dragon Ball Z piccolo? Oh, okay, that's fair. A hen, a rooster, Ooh. a ram, a donkey, another, another donkey. donkey, an alpaca, a boar, a bull. Yeah, we got some options. Let's keep going down. Let's see. Got more geese. We have plenty of geese, I think, at this point. Should we buy um, buy something just to slaughter, maybe? We could. We could. That sounds so like apocalypse now. Um, I mean, what are we gonna do if we get to? We've got rams right or goats right now, right? What are we gonna do if we get a one alpaca or a donkey? So we could get. For example, um, you know, an alpaca, and then hope to get, uh, I think it was a male alpaca, so then we would hope to get a female, a female alpaca in sure. a different caravan. Um, we could also go for that hen and rooster, just to have a different type of eggs. Sure. That could be fun. They're cheap. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, we could get that ram and slaughter. That's probably the most, the cheapest... Or actually, that boar is even cheaper. Yeah. If we want to get. Yummy. Let's slaughter that boar. Um, That's about it see. for the animals. And then a lot of weapons and. I'm weirdly excited about slaughtering <laughs> About animal. cooking this boar. Um, a lot of boots and caps yeah. and. Probably some nothing else in here we want. Some caps. Oh, maybe some different types of plant seeds. Sure. Did we're I, we're doing did pretty I just well. Pass any seeds? I feel like so I, there's some plump, plump helmet spawns. Sweet pods. I feel like some more seeds can't really yeah. hurt. Rock nuts are technically seeds. Are they? Yeah. Do they grow rocks or? Mmm, delicious. No, they grow one of the dwarven plants. Um, yeah, same with those. Ooh, that, why is that one so expensive? There was a one that was 50 up above. Uh, oh no, I was looking at the plump helmet spawn. Right. We Let's are here. producing all of these plants though, yeah, so. I'll buy them from yeah. whatever. Okay. Let's see what Trade. else we got. Cloth bins, lots of. Lots of stuff we don't really need. Cool. Do Let's we want see. a steel anvil? No. 
that better than the anvil we have? Yeah, I'm not sure what, what the difference in material do for... I think maybe a different type of workshop right, might I'm require it. it. That's all we need. You don't want any uh, fun fish? No. Okay. Forget fish. Should we give him this figure? Um, that one actually hasn't been... Um... So no. Yeah. Maybe, maybe the, one of the shields we made? Let's save the shields for next time because they're going to give us really a better rate. Them. Yeah. Um, we could do the high boot. I mean, we might as well do the figurine. Nobody's decorating it. Yeah. Let's see. So that, that might be enough. See if he'll do it. Oops. Uh, is it T? T. T to yeah. trade. Oh, so he wants Ooh. more. That's what that means. Counter offer. Which is fine. They can take that stuff. <laughs> and one piece of phyllite. All right, dude. Yeah. I'm, sure. Take it. Yeah. Oh, wonderful. Cool. So let's, uh, oops. Just want to turn that off. So nobody has to sit around yep. there. And then set your goods to. I'm going to set Sibrek back on. On is, uh, wall, stone. wall making, stone working. There it is. Masonry. And, um,. We should uh, set set the goods that are there to, to be not taken. be trading anymore. Yeah. G. Yep. Cool. Maybe we should move this stuff back too. Yep. We can see if they've dug out that space for your new. Um, I forget. Is there a way to just? Oh, I can hit. No, that. no. So the way that you'll move them off off of the trading depot is by having a stockpile where they can be moved to. Gotcha. So that's that's the only reason that's they're still there. Yeah. Me. That's right. So cool. So they'll start moving that stuff off. I bet the uh, next time we yep. can slaughter a boar. Stockpile. Gonna do this. Now how did we set it to just be everything before? So just create it and then go into it and gotcha. uh, and set it for everything. Oop. Cool. So you don't want it to be food. Um, we don't want corpses or refuse or stone. Or stone. Ammo, so by corpse. everything you mean just like some stuff. And actually let's take bars blocks off too. Yeah. Um, gems, yeah, sure. Um, let me see, you don't want wood either. Um, and then gems we actually have that uh, a spot for them, so that's really up to you. I don't think yeah. it's overflowed. Probably not. Overflowing, we can go check it out actually. Yeah, no, it's fine. They got plenty of room in that stockpile. This is your, the bottom one's your gem workshop. They've got all these yeah. boxes. Bins, please. Excuse me. And cool. on, on that note, let's wrap this up. Love it. Uh, Slaughtering a boar. I'm gonna, I think next time we should work on your theory that we might not be producing enough wealth by getting somebody to just start doing a lot of yep. crafting. And... I think if somebody's cutting and encrusting, um, like one dwarf just have them doing jewel stuff, mm -hmm. gem stuff, and then That'll one really dwarf. build up some value. Yeah, and then one dwarf just making some like gold crafts, more gold crafts. Bye merchants. Bye. Bye. And goodbye, Wes. Bye, Will. Goodbye, Dwarf Fortress. Goodbye, Moon. <laughs>